Um, I think there are three things. I think the first thing to say is uh, uh, what is becoming clear now is that uh, uh, the Prime Minister misled Parliament. I'm not allowed to say this in Parliament, but how many lies does it take? How many lies does it take to the British public or to uh, Parliament before this Prime Minister will put the uh, moral integrity of our country before his personal ambition and his personal position and do the decent thing and resign. I am fed up of having to be part of an administration where I am ashamed of the actions and the approach of our Prime Minister. So I think that's the first thing. We're going to have to have that privileges. The other thing to say is uh, we saw that from the Panorama programme last night, Mm -hmm. that actually what is so dreadful about this is that a lot of the younger junior staff in Downing Street, they're the ones that have picked up the fines. Again, Teflon Boris Johnson is trying, is, thinks he's going to get away with it. And I think that is deeply, deeply, deeply unfair. It's a culture. In the end, he should take responsibility for what he did. He shouldn't, you know, what, why are the fines being levied on, 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 uh, on the more junior staff in Number 10? That seems all wrong. And to say this wasn't part of this is just crazy. You know, bins overflowing with wine bottles the day after, you know, people sitting on each other's laps. How much do you more evidence do we want to, to know that there was a culture there where drinking, boozing parties was part of the way in which they operated, when the rest of the British public were not able to attend, uh, be with their loved ones as they were dying, when people couldn't so go to that's funerals. That's for the police. Though. The police decided who to find. You, surely that you're not implying that they've somehow, well, I can, somehow been influenced. Kevin, the other thing I would say <laughs> is I am really interested. I want transparency on how the police approach their work. And I think we really need to understand. No, no, I'm not doing a comp- I just want to know. It just doesn't make common sense. It's a common sense approach. I want to know I think we've got to why they took to do their job. Really. Well, let's have transparency about okay. it. We I you and I believe in transparency. Kevin.